Hey guys, it's Tina here. Welcome back to Transform with Tina. In today's video, I'm gonna show you a quick and easy five minute glowy makeup look and how you can go from this to this. If you haven't already, make sure you click subscribe below to stay updated with future videos. And also please help me get to 2 million subscribers by the end of this year. I'm almost at 1.8, so it's slowly getting there. For the past week, I've been pretty sick and my skin has been super dehydrated. It's dull, there's like patches of red everywhere. It's just not like sexy. So I've been doing this five minute like glowy makeup look every morning to try to revive a little bit of life back into my skin. This would be a perfect look for those sick days, if you're hungover, if you wake up late and you don't have a lot of time to get ready. This is like the perfect glowy skin makeup you can do. Today I'm gonna to run through the steps in my skin prep, so it's gonna take a little bit longer than five minutes, but if you're doing this at home yourself, it shouldn't take you any longer than like five to 10 minutes. Before I apply any makeup, I wanna run through how I prep my skin in the morning. Um, this is really important because this will make your makeup last longer. And especially if you're doing a glowy look, you don't want any like dry patches on your skin. So I'm going to apply my favorite moisturizer. This is the Kiehl's Ultra Facial Moisturizer. I'm going to apply a generous amount all over my skin. I'm just gonna work that in and you know when your skin when you're sick, your skin is super dehydrated, or even when you're like hungover, your skin is just gonna suck this baby up. I think a lot of people make the mistake of not applying enough moisturizer, so I like to be really generous with this. Then I'm going to go in with eye cream. This is the AccuTop Rosy Eye Cream, and I'm just gonna pop it underneath my eyes and just like tap it in. This is um, really good for those of you who have like dryness or if you find that your concealer starts to crack or crease a little bit, just apply eye cream over that area before you apply makeup. So like what I'm doing now and let it sit for like five to 10 minutes and let it fully absorb into your skin first, then go in with makeup. Lastly, I'm going to apply the Laneige Lip Sleeping Mask. You guys know how dry my lips get. They get really chapped and a lot of people comment about it, but lately I've been using this before bed. So I'll apply it on um, and then also in the morning after I do my skincare, I'll apply a layer of this on and it's actually helped so much. So I'm looking all shiny and crazy at the moment, but I like to leave that on my skin for about five to 10 minutes, let it all absorb and then start my makeup. So usually after in the morning, I brush my teeth, cleanse my face and then do this routine. Once everything is absorbed, I'm ready to move on to my five minute glowy skin makeup. I'll be applying the Mecha Max Bring On Bright Illuminating Primer. I'm just gonna apply this using my fingers everywhere. This has a really nice smell. It's like, it's florally. It smells really nice. Actually, maybe a bit citrusy. Maybe I'm sick and I just can't smell. As you can see, this gives my skin a really nice glowy base. And obviously we want that because we wanna bring back some life into our skin. Then for foundation, I've been using this new one. It's the YSL All Hours Foundation. I'm just going to apply it using my fingers. Now usually YSL foundations, they have more of like a glow finish, but this one is actually more of like a matte finish. But since I've applied the primer underneath and I'm shearing the foundation out with my fingers, it should still be a little bit dewy. So when you have like five minutes to get ready in the morning, I just like forget about my brushes and I'll just use my fingers. For concealer, I'll be applying the NARS Soft Matte Complete Concealer in Custard. And to save time, I like to just dip my beauty blender, the tip of it, into the concealer and then just like blend it out. I also like to apply concealer into this inner corner here, just to brighten up my whole eye. And then just cover up any like redness you normally get. I'm then going to set that area with my Perfect Setting Powder from Cover FX. And I'm gonna sneeze. I'm gonna try not to sneeze. I made it. Oh, my eyes are watering. The struggles of being sick and trying to apply makeup. I'm just gonna lightly pat those areas with the powder. Just like the oily areas, just your T-zone. Then I'm going to go into the Mecha Max Triple Threat Cream Face Shaper Palette. I'm going to use my Beauty Blender and go into the highlight shade first. 
And I'm just gonna blend that onto the high points of my face, just really quickly with the Beauty Blender. Then the pink shade as blush. This is like a super quick and easy way to apply your makeup. Especially like cream products. I just love using the Beauty Blender to blend it out. Then the bronzing shade just around the perimeters of my face. And then to quickly set that, I'm using my MAC bronzer just over the areas that I've applied the bronzing cream. I feel like bronzer just wakes you up, you know, it just gives you that colour and life back again. I'm also going to pop that colour over my lids. Then I'm going to quickly fill in my eyebrows. I'm just doing a natural eyebrow look today with the um, Urban Decay Micro Pencil, I think. The Brow Beater Micro Fine Brow Pencil. So just following my natural shape. Just want to keep it pretty soft and natural. Plus you don't have a lot of time in the morning or you don't really want to spend a lot of time when you're sick either. I'm going to give my lashes a quick curl. Curling your lashes just opens up your eyes and makes them look so much bigger and awake. For mascara, I'll be applying my Kevin Aquan Volume Mascara. This is my favourite mascara at the moment. I love the wand to this because it's actually like the perfect size. It's not too small, but it's not huge either. And the formula holds my curl really well. You can see just a few strokes of that and suddenly I have lashes. As you can see now I have lashes. This mascara, you have to try it if you're looking for a new mascara. Kevin Aquan Volume Mascara. You can get it at Mecca. So this is the final look. Super glowy, healthy looking skin. Definitely don't look sick anymore. Like I said before, this is a perfect look. If you're running short on time, if you're not feeling too well, if you're hungover, this is a really quick and easy makeup look to do. So that's it for this video. I hope you guys have enjoyed today's Transform with Tina. Hopefully you learned some new tips and tricks that you can apply with your own makeup routine, which will hopefully speed things up in the morning. Also, if you haven't already, make sure you click subscribe below to stay updated with future videos and I'll speak to you guys next time. Bye.